just always looks for like some sort of controversy. There's always I I, I get it's tiring. I can't deal with that kind of person all the time. And he thrives on chaos, which I guess is to be expected, but I don't really see it to the same degree in anyone else. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's why we don't talk anymore. Because I have. <clears throat> and he claims that I'm like I don't know if he said stupid, but he definitely said boring, like not mentally stimulating. Um we live our lives completely differently. Um, he said that to you. Yeah, I <laughs> am a horrible mom and he can't he can't believe that I have two kids that Oh I, Jesus uh, Christ. Not even yeah, like he just <laughs> well, I really don't even think that he meant that. I think he was just saying shit because he thought it would get to you. But yeah, I know. Yeah, it's something is just going right for the jugular. Whatever he thinks will hurt you, but well, it's, it has nothing to do with like. Yeah, he's like honestly, in my opinion, I think he's like textbook psychopath. <laughs> but that's just me because he'll act all warm and nice to you when. He- He's getting to know you, and then everything I told him, or a lot of things I told him, he used it against me. Like, so he used all that as ammo later on, or like, so for that last hurrah he had, like, basically everything I shared with him, he turned it around as a negative thing. Like, look at all these things you're doing bad. Like, you're an awful person. Ugh. I, I mean, I'm, yeah, I just won't even comment any further, but I don't really give that much away on the internet, even if I click with someone. I just assume that they're going to do that. So I'd never talk to them about anything I'm serious unless I'm like, you know, there's a layer of like sarcasm or me joking around it. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm just done with one on one conversation with people. I like group talk. It's- you can like check in and out and still listen. Mm-hmm. That's a good question, Carolyn. I don't know. I mean, because there would be sometimes where the conversation would be good, so we'd talk. But then just like all the conflict outweighed. Of a cookie pot. So we don't talk anymore, though. What about you, Magnus? How many looks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll Center of a Tootsie Pop? The world may never know. The frustrating thing about analyzing people like that is the fact that the one person that you want to reach with that information is not going to hear it. So... Just learn from the interaction and move on. Yeah, we actually are talking about your boyfriend. I feel like... (laughs) He's probably going to come in here and, like, troll or something now. Except you talking about... (sighs) Whatever. Fucking... Oh, you actually agree, huh? No. What do you guys think about the Moab being dropped? Learn about what being dropped? They dropped the. They call it the mother of all bombs. It's basically the largest non nuclear bomb ever created, and it's never been used until recently when we dropped one on like an underground den full of terrorists. Where? Afghanistan. 
Oh no. Like so. Well, how recent was that? I am so out of the loop. <laughs> it's so good. It's way better to be out of the loop. It's all news that. <laughs> Like, they tell you what happened, but you don't really know what exactly happened or why. Yeah. So, we can only know that we're all yeah. going to die very shortly. Okay. Well, that was nice. But it happened very recently, like, like last week, I think. Three days ago? Five days ago? Something like that. Right, who's the funny guy who's typing loudly? It's probably me. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. I just I would I wanted a player. I have a mechanical keyboard, so it sounds really loud. Oh, like a typewriter. Yeah, Magnus is one of those guys who has his, his fucking leg suspended in the air and shit like that. Get on mic, Magnus. Get on cam too. We'll throw coins at you. I mean, don't get on mic. I don't want to hear your gross. We'll give you coins to reach voice. your goal. We hear it. Magnus. <laughs> Magnus. Magnissimo. Come on, Kim, may putty. Magnus. Magnus. The hill on Kim, motherfucker. <laughs> not, not motherfucker, but Magnus. Get on Kim. <laughs> 10 out of 10 reverse psychology. Oh, there's motherfucker. Get on Kim, my asshole. That's cool. Or I take it a choose chopstick and I shove it up your ass. I take my American beating stick and I shove it up your ass. Motherfucker 2 is, is Mark? Which Mark? Is there there's more than one Mark? Wahlberg. I'm not Mark. <laughs> what did that say? Cornledge? I can't read what it says in your picture. Probably something in Danish. Yeah. Get on the microphone. What right now. <laughs> I just came. Oh my god. That's what happens. Go ahead and be rude and nasty and warranted. That's what happens when you're a motherfucker. Yo, let's single him out. This fucking INTJ guy, quote unquote, legend. Single him out. It's all gang up on him. Go ahead and be rude and nasty, unwarranted. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. He talking shit. I'm already broken. You might as well break this ball. I like when people wear their hoods like this, like it's barely on their head. Because it looks cool. Yeah. Like cool. Yo. Got that swag. Check. Check. Check me out. You try and act like a like a cool kid for for a minute. Uh. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. No. 
Yellow, everybody swag, swag, swag. I got my swag, then a yellow boy. Told you I got solo riding with my demo plate rim, son. Well, that's the motto, nigga. That's the motto. Pretend like you just took just like, money. Plays with the game, but if I wasn't hit it, then I hate the same it. thing. Okay. That's, that's not bad. Um, yellow swag, yellow swag, snap back, niggas. Nigga, nigga, pussy in the club. All right, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> you know, that's some really good modern rap, actually. Yeah. <laughs> so ironically deep. <laughs> it's deep on so many levels. Dude, that hit me. That that really gets me where I feel, bro. You don't even. You can't even. You're not even convinced that way. Niggas want to fight me. Fight these tears. <laughs> you ain't a real gangster if you don't love your mom. <laughs> Nothing's better than being a. Can you do some more dumb. freestyle? That was good. Hmm. That was good. Do some more freestyle. Nothing's cooler than loving your dad. Being in the room is the worst experience I've ever fucking had. I don't. I can't think of anything else. Was the first part freestyle like the earlier when you were going real fast? The what? Never mind. Which part? Like the whole thing before N word, N word, pussy in the club. <laughs> N-word? Did you oh. seriously just say that, Neptune? Uh, yeah. God damn it. Just, just say, just, just say nigga. Just say it. Don't yeah. know what to do. Stop hiding behind the first letter. So unnecessary, I'd rather just say N-word. You so unnecessary. You know what's also unnecessary? Saying N-word instead of nigger. Hey, don't put that R on there. Nigger. No, nigga. You don't say nigga. You say nigga. You just nigga said is just nigga. hiding behind it. Nigga. It's like, oh, it's a totally different word if I change the last letter. What How up, niggardly. Oh. That's very niggardly of you. I said that in class the other day, niggardly. <laughs> and I got in trouble for it. And I and I, I fucking educated my class so hard. Basically, my yeah. How I educated just like, my class, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How is this kid not in the NTT? Come on. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. All right, so before I basically, I said, I said niggerly in class That's because I'm not giving money oh. to anyone. Any, any money he gets, he shoves it straight up his ass. His exact words. And I said, That's very niggerly of you. And then everyone looked at me like, Whoa, whoa, dude, you can't say that, dude. And then my teacher got super upset and was gonna like say, "Come on, get off us!" I'm like, "I'm like, hold on." I pulled, I literally pulled out a dictionary. I looked it up and I showed them the definition of niggerly, not nigger, mind you. I didn't say that. But I said the definition of niggerly is not generous or and or stingy. I'm gonna use that now. Whoa. <clears throat> His actions proved him. Nigger. So, had I said the word nigger, why does my teacher not get upset when people call me zipperhead? Is it because the word nigger has history? All offensive words have history. I'm not fucking Saren, but she wants to talk shit and call me Saren, but all you people decided to be nasty to me, but <laughs> whatever, I don't care. <laughs> That was unnecessary. When you do that voice, when you do that voice, there's so many emotions. I can't explain how I feel. Just uh, you're an overgrown <laughs> person. What does that mean? Like in one, <laughs> one hand. <laughs> it must be hard to be a six foot five woman, you know. <laughs> I am. She has no life. You are an overgrown person. Keep bringing shit up.